how to fix Firefox if it's running slow. Update Firefox to the latest version. Open Firefox. Go to the menu. Look for Help. Select it. And then select About Firefox. Firefox will check for updates and if a new update is found, it will download them automatically. Once the process is complete, restart Firefox. Enable hardware acceleration. Open Firefox and then type about preferences into the address bar. Press the enter key on your keyboard to be redirected to the preferences page. Stay on the general tab and then scroll down until you see the performance section. Here, make sure that Use Recommended Performance Settings option is not selected. A new option should become visible. Enable Use Hardware Acceleration when available to turn on Hardware Acceleration. See if your browser is faster now. Manage your tabs. Close the new tabs to make sure they don't hang onto your resources. Try the extension and automatically suspend inactive ones, or you can manually close them yourself. First, click on Add to Firefox. This will install this add-on called AutoDAP Discard by Richard Niobe. Click on Add, and then you can allow this extension to run in private windows. Select it and click OK. If this does not solve the problem, let's move on to the next method. Clear your cache, cookies and history. From the Firefox menu, click on settings from the available options. Here, you will have to switch to the privacy and security page. Scroll down until you see the cookies and site data header. Click on the clear data button to open the interface. Select both options and then wait for Firefox to finish clearing your data. When the first process is done, scroll down to the History section. Here, click the Clear History button. Select which items you want to remove. Make sure to carefully review what's selected so you don't lose crucial information like your saved passwords. Once you've selected everything you want to remove, Click OK. Disable add-ons. In Firefox, click on the menu button and then select add-ons and themes from the context menu. Switch to the extensions tab. Check if you notice any extensions you don't use anymore or suspicious entries. To disable any of these add-ons, you just have to move these switches. You can also check your themes. Maybe you are using one that is making Firefox running slow. Minimize memory usage. To do it, type in about memory into the address bar. Press enter key on your keyboard to be redirected to the memory management page. Under the free memory section, click on the minimize memory usage button. After this, the browser will release all memory it doesn't need to use, which may help. Disable Firefox Data Collection. Navigate to Settings and then go to Privacy and Security. Scroll down on the page until you see the Firefox Data Collection Use Header. Make sure that all options in section are unchecked. Restart your browser and check if your experience is better. Tweaks in the Advanced Configuration. I'm going to leave you a link to all these codes so you can copy them and paste them. Once you have them, open Firefox, type about config in the URL bar, press enter, and accept that you will be careful. So all you have to do now is just copy the codes and paste them as I am doing. Copy the process for all of the codes, and this will help you improve your experience in Firefox. Just see how am I doing here. Just copy this, 
paste them here in Firefox. In this case, edit the number and then click OK. Keep in mind that I am not saving the changes because my Firefox works just fine. But it's important that you respect the changes suggested by the codes. Refresh Firefox. Open Firefox and then type About Support into the address bar. Press the Enter key on your keyboard to be redirected to this page. First try Clear Startup Cache and restart your Firefox. After restarting Firefox, click when it says Refresh Firefox. Wait for the program to be restarted, click on Finish, and that's it. You can also restore all windows and tabs. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments. If you want to keep watching and learning from our videos, please subscribe to our channel and don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.